Hello everybody and thank you Arte Generali for inviting me. It is a pleasure to be here. Well, I'm a certified art security manager, but I'm also an art historian specialized in museology, museography and protection of cultural heritage. I have more than 20 years experience in museums. The most important are the Prada Foundation and the National Museums of Science and Technology in Milan. I have also worn a uniform joined the Carabinieri Corps till 2021. It was my favorite professional experience ever. <laughs> Well, it is fundamental to have a good balance between active and passive security system, organizational and procedural steps, staff effectiveness. For instance, if I'm responsible for the protection of museum storage, I need to guarantee armor door and gratings, the passive security system, Alarm and CCTV camera, the active security system, and the first and foremost immediate response for a staff who is prepared to face emergency situation. Of course, if any of these steps were to be missed, I would have failed in the protection of the storehouse. The use of technology in our job is crucial. It is absolutely necessary, although in my opinion it's not the determining factor. What's made the, the difference is the people, how they are trained, supervised, motivating and supported in doing their job. Regarding this, the greatest responsibility for the winning the our security manager. As a matter of fact, if my team doesn't work well, it is solely my responsibility. So again, you can have the best technology in the world, but if you don't have reliable people by your side, it is all in vain. I stand by that. A brilliant risk manager has to prepare for the worst and needs to be ready for anything. Especially based on my experience in the Carabinieri Corp, you are not allowed to make mistakes. You just can't. This is shouldn't scare you off, but it is should be used as a reason to improve yourself every day. Surely the main characteristic of risk manager are attention to detail, flexibility, preparedness and ability to read under the line. Compared to a few decades ago, the cultural of security in companies and museums grow by leaps and bounds. But there is still a lot of work to be done. In my opinion, the major obstacle is in continuing to compartmentalize there needs to be more cooperation and an open dialogue between different departments because risk management is a subject that should involve the entire organization by applying an holistic approach. Even more so in the field of museums because in addition to safety and security, there is a protection of collections loans, transportation, public welcoming, and so on. Another thing that could certainly be announced is the attention to the employee disloyalty and the reputational aspect of the museum. See the recent case of the British Museum in London. This is my favorite question because I believe a lot in the new generation and I love working with them. The first advice is uh, certainly to continue studying a lot and never get tired of it. It is the first condition. Then surely embrace a multidisciplinary approach involving history of art, risk management, 
museum management, national and international law, and so on. The more you have an open mind, the greater the outcome of the job will be. Specifically, if you are in the synergy with other professional figures. Studying and keeping up with current affairs is important, but it's not enough. You have to spend a long time inside the museum to understand how they work and also the different nuances of the organization. Briefing the tension felt during events and opening night. Leave the opening of the boxes when the museum receives works on loan from other institutions. It is such a thrilling experience. I also suggest not stay in the same workplace for a long time but to have the courage to have a new working experiences. It is definitely the most difficult choice, I know, but is the one that will make you stronger, authentic and self-confident. <laughs> of course, I'm happy to answer any questions from the new generation of risk managers. Bye.